Americans are fat. Blame the economy, busy lifestyles, access to junk, it doesn't matter. Americans are fat. There's actually concern that children today will be less healthy than their parents. The percentage of adults aged 20 years and over who are overweight or obese, the percentage of adults aged 20 years and over who are obese, the percentage of adolescents aged 12 to 19 who are overweight, the percentage of children aged 6 to 11 years old who are overweight. I want to cover everybody. President Obama has said his health care plan would push prevention as well as care. Already there's talk of a junk food tax. Well, how about not just pushing what America shouldn't eat, but reward what they should? Now, truth be told, I'm slowly adopting a vegetarian lifestyle. It's been a long process, giving up beef and pork about three years ago, poultry around two years, and now lessening the amount of fish I eat over the past year. I believe no one can go vegetarian cold turkey. <laughs> My turning point was Peppa, one cranky parrot. We inherited her and she decided I was its mate. There was lots of grooming she enjoys sitting on my shoulder. She gets excited when I get home. And as I observed her, I noticed that there were real emotions and real reactions to her world. She gets happy, excited, scared. Now, granted, a chicken may not be as smart as a parrot, but I can't believe that they don't have the same emotions. I can't eat poultry. It may be somebody's mate. It's cheaper. It's a fact. When you buy non-processed vegetarian, it's way cheaper than fast food. It's a fact. Vegetarians and vegans live longer, on average six to ten years longer than meat eaters, according to a study from Loma Linda University. They have lower rates of cancer, 40% less, heart disease, 60% less, along with fewer cases of stroke and diabetes. It's a fact. Vegetarians are slimmer and are able to control their weight easier. Meat eaters are nine times more likely to be obese than vegans. The consumption of meat, eggs, and dairy products has also been strongly linked to osteoporosis, Alzheimer's, asthma, and male impotence. And these are all issues that will face an aging America in the next few years, if not already. Think about it, boomers. What if you all lived a long time and still felt and looked good? Vegetarians help the environment. According to a new report published by the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, the livestock sector generates more greenhouse gas emissions, 18% more, than cars. It takes on average 25 gallons to produce a pound of vegetables or fruit. It takes 5,214 to produce one pound of beef. And finally, yes, I do it for the animals too. Paul McCartney once said, that if slaughterhouses had glass walls, everyone would be a vegetarian. Get a big tongue. Oh, you like that, huh?